So my next song that I want to talk about is by a rapper named Live with his song Thirst. Alright, cool. Sipping water, sipping dreams, think about it, what's it gon' be? I'm only macho, don't mo guitar, ole G. That's so dreji, I didn't got, jungi na, teach your gigi, I go with some ma, but your ma. Sipping water, sipping dreams, think about it, what's it gon' be? I'm only macho, don't mo guitar, ole G. That's so dreji, I didn't got, jungi na, teach your gigi, I go with some ma, gorgi. Back home from the 95 till they have that said fuck that out of shit They manga saying got to the J Jong me head and get on my rocket ship Cause I don't give a shit about them haters say goodbye I'm about to get back some fuck Maybe you've oh, never ever heard of this Chingu. I've never heard of this. I've never heard of this Chingu. Um, but he is an artist He's from this label called yeah. DPR. Dream Perfect Regime. Yeah. Which uh, is a label started by ex-C Clown member Rome. You remember yeah. C Clown, right, guys? Yeah, you remember C Clown, right? Uh, actually, I do remember C Clown. I, I remember C Clown. I remember they doing like all sorts of weird. I remember they had that like really old school Korean sounding song. Yeah, we, we were really we were cool. pretty down with that. Yeah, that we were pretty really down cool. with that. And then they kind of disbanded and had you know, yeah. problems with the company. Yeah. But uh, anyway, so live happens to be that C Clown member's uh, Rome's uh, younger brother. Um, now you might think, oh man, this is like a boy group label, but like, n no, this is uh, a ripping it rap fucking song. I was really surprised when I first heard the song because I really was not expecting anything like this. Yeah. Um, this kind of song is really up my alley. It's a very chill, laid back kind of hip hop track, uh, kind of reminiscent of like Lupe Fiasco, um, like early Lupe Fiasco. And it's just kind of a song that you just nod your head to. It's a very good hip hop song in my opinion. But, but I think... It's very different than, um, like, for example, another nod your head, chill hip hop track we talked about was like, uh, Loco and Gray's Good. Right. Right. That one is a more Korean yeah. hip hop song. Right. Yeah. And I think this one is way more American. -y. Yeah. It's, it, he uses a lot of English in the song. And I think that's so special, um, because there are times, uh, at least in Korean, uh, just the way the sentence structure is made up. Like, the verb is always at the end. So you'll have, like, you know, it, it's easier to rhyme, but it gets really, really boring. Yeah. And I think a huge problem that uh, Good had was that it was very, very repetitive and nothing really broke it up. Yeah. But this song does a really good, like, I don't know what it is, but it's kind of just like a, a break. It has, like, a chorus part. Yeah, it. it just kind of yeah. takes a break and it really balances out the song from being just really, really repetitive because... You know, really laid back kind of hip hop tracks. Yeah. They suffer from like being repetitive and such. But know? it's also a very short song. It's yeah. only like two minutes and 14 seconds or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that could also be yeah. part of it. Um, but the music video, the music video is rather interesting mm -hmm. because it is definitely a video where you're like, this director, he did some drugs. Someone was doing some drugs. He did some drugs. drugs. Um, there's just all sorts of like weird scenes of like, him like in a river and then like instead of the sky it's like whales and but, fish but i do have to say like some of the cinematography that he uses i think is really interesting like mm. there's one part i think where he's just walking on the road and he's kind of tripping out and the sky is kind of doing a weird like green screeny thing and yeah. he falls over and then he falls into like a pool yeah yeah, yeah. i and thought that was really cool there's a really cool like reverse slow motion shot of him blowing smoke out of mm -hmm. his mouth it, although it's in reverse so it's being sucked in mm -hmm. but like it goes on for a really long time and i don't smoke but it it seemed like an awful lot of smoke coming out of that man's mouth mm, um, maybe vaping or, you know. i don't know but it, i thought it was pretty cool it, it's always cool it, i mean that's why you know you watch the slow-mo guys on youtube because mm -hmm. everything in slow motion involving smoke and shit like that stuff. So, right right um but it is definitely um Drinking and drugs. Someone on drugs. But if but if you're really into like the laid back hip hop style, 
you know, the Chingus that more aligned with my taste rather than Steven's, this song is really, really for you. Like, really go check it out. Not too sure how many views it has or how many listens it how has. Many? Um, because I've tried to look it up on Melon. It doesn't come up on Melon. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's like on SoundCloud and YouTube. Pretty think it's much only, only. I mean, it's all. Uh, it's on YouTube, but mm-hmm. I think uh, it's only on SoundCloud. Like, I, mm-hmm. it didn't. I didn't see any links to iTunes or Melon or any, you know, downloading yeah. program. It's, it's gonna get. It's pretty hard to listen to, and I think it's kind of a gem to listen to if you're a fan of that. It's probably a seven in my book. Yeah, definitely look out for for him because mm-hmm. uh, it'd be interesting to hear him do. A He's whole a good number. rapper. Yeah. He's a good rapper. Yeah, I, I liked. It. I, I mm-hmm. like. Um, I don't know if I like him more than I probably might have liked him more than good because I didn't really like uh, that local song that much. Mm-hmm. Um, 